Good evening. Uh, welcome to dot programming dot blogspot dot com. Uh, today I'm talking about uh, uh, the tax box control. Tax box is input control in which we can take inputs uh, in a browser, or you can say uh, inputs from keyboards in a browser window. So simply add a tax box control in uh, design page uh, that is about one page dot aspx. So add it and change the property of the text mod because I'm talking about uh, text mod property of the text box so change the property of the text box actually text mod property is represent the different types of text uh, in it we in it we can take it okay so here is a by default property is a single line now run it application in the browser you can check it only the single line you can uh, type here that is the fffffff okay gh 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 uh, only single line support when we uh, change the property that is single line to multi line that is multi line change the property of the multi line uh, and run it this application uh, refresh it yeah you can take some inputs uh, in a multi line we know about the password property so also support the text mode property is to password some special characters we can take it in the single line only yeah some special character like dot 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 you know uh, the version of the html is html5 so um, HTML5 also supports some validations also uh, like the email when we set the property of the email uh, the change okay uh, let's talk about the HTML5 what is the uh, identification of the HTML5 is doc type is HTML mm, that is uh, inside in it the master page that is the doc type is HTML so is a uh, HTML5 and HTML5 supports uh, the validations like the email validations mm. remove the some text box from the text uh, to change it this is the previous video tutorial uh, so removed it this line yeah uh, it's a very uh, very very uh, important things because mm, no declaration part so uh, removed it now check the email property on browser window uh, that is a support the validations uh, by the text box uh, refresh it oh one uh, one thing is, is needed the page is post back uh, every events so use uh, take it single button control so in the br line uh, for the new line and add a button control in it and check the validations control when we um, button is pressed the um, post back event is raised uh, so do it check this the validations is occurred here that is the email so thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorial about the text mod property